Well, the heat is very much on here at Cooper Stadium today. Not just the 38 degree temperatures, but on the Adelaide United players as well for their slow starts and what Hircham Bavay calls their lack of focus. But it's also on the Wanderers after that seven game winless run. Didn't really have the answers. Just all too easy at the moment for them to make those incursions, Andy. There's a loose ball though from Jordan Elsie again showing his rustiness. Mitch Duke and there's open pasture ahead of Mohamed Adam here. Meyer in the middle and it's headed in by Nikolai Muller. The German relieves the pressure on his German coach. Adam with the assist and Nikolai Muller applies the finishing touch for just his second goal for the Wanderers. Bayern Munich or the National Mannschaft. Here's Miloznic fed by Halloran and they're all square. It's Al Hassan Torre with the tap in. They work that beautifully, the Reds, and they're back all square. And Al Hassan Torre is back on target for the first time since the opening weekend of the season. So the Adelaide corner from Truisi, and it's got over the line, I think. Well, no, there's no flag. George Blackwood was claiming the goal. We'll continue with Mitch Duke. That'll be an interesting one to look at again on the replay. Meantime, advantage play for the foul on Mitch Duke, who's now in a bit of a chop at Ben Halloran. And things started to happen all over the pitch here. Mitch Duke incensed by the foul, and then the follow up contribution of Ben Halloran. Okay, that's it. Free kick. It's the breakaway from the corner. This was nearly a goal. Lopar again, magnificent. Oh, it's Lopar again with the VAR goal line stuff. Goodness oh. me, how many times this season? He may as well be at the MCG. He gets the pad to the pitch of the ball beautifully. <laughs> and again, he's behind the line. It means we're going to see Mitch Duke at the point of the attack, which is where he wants to play. Elrich, useful ball, incidentally. Oh, what a goal! What a header from Nikolai Muller from a long way out. And the German has a double, and he used his head. That's what he's saying to those Wanderers fans in the corner. It is a bullet header, and it's 2-1 Western Sydney. And the Wanderers a power of good if they could get the three points tonight. And Mohamed Adams gone through, and he could seal it here. And he gets it second time off Paul Lizzo and fires it home. His first goal in the A-League, and the Wanderers are 3-1 up. And that might be enough for the three points. Now Al Hassan Torre sneaking in on the blind side of Yerman. Yerman's back goal side now though. Has the chance gone for the Reds? Oh! I think it's a penalty. Yeah. First decision is penalty, and I think that's the right option. It is George Blackwood. Confident finish. Back to 3-2. Game on. Free kick floated towards the box, steered clear by Georgievski, not far enough though. Oh, did that come off the arm of Georgievski? But that I've seen it and his arms were in. Yeah. Now, is there going to be compelling evidence that I got it wrong the first time? Like irrefutable, obvious error type evidence. I, I, I don't know, anyway. Penalty. <laughs> there you go, Hart. There you go. Can Blackwood succeed again? It's all on this. Oh, and he's put it over the crossbar. You could not make this stuff up. And there we go, full time. And to say that is a much needed win for the Wanderers is something of an understatement. Daniel Georgievski still with plenty to say to the officials, still fuming about the award of those two penalties, well, particularly the second one.